showing next the Weekenders, and this is going to cover three and four shelf Weekenders, both organic and as well Caladet and as well Mission. They're all the same format, same die with different print on it. What we have now with the detachable tray is the display comes in like this with the tray nicked in place. By nicked in place, it means we die cut it, but we leave enough of the board so that it stays in place. And if you choose not to use the partition, the uh, salsa tray, I'll show you uh, how it folds together in a moment, but if you choose not to use it, you can just dispose of it and the rest of the display is ready to go. You always want to start by folding in the flanges and get a stable base, and that's just folding these over like so. And then you're going to get a more firm display as you set it up. Just push it down, so you get them all folded under. You can see from the inside when they're in place, and then uh, you can see down there. So that works. And I'm going to take and be careful on the scores like this. Sometimes you have to wiggle it back and forth to get an even score. What we're trying to avoid is what's called false scoring. That is when we bend it and the board goes somewhere in a direction, bending in a direction that's not meant to be. So you want to be uh, kind of sensitive or aware of the fact that the, uh, the board has to be bent sometimes, several times to, to fold over clear, cleanly. Then we're grabbing these side slots here, which gives the, the support on all, uh, all four sides. You can see even on the back of the display. Um, so we're going to grab this, just use my finger to run along, and then the shelf's going to sit in place. See how that works? And a nice, clean score line here. And I'll be adding the salsa tray here in just a moment. But I'm going to be doing the same thing with shelf number two. Again, I want to keep any false scoring from happening by using my hands and, and uh, folding that score over gently uh, back and forth before I take and fold it over. Again, catching the, uh, the sides here to give it support. The third, or the middle shelf and the bottom shelf have just the uh, side supports. Um, and a little pre-scoring helps fold it better. Folding it in. Catching the side just by using my fingers. Push that side tab in. Same thing on the other side, and we're done. On the four shelf display, it's the same thing. There's just an additional shelf in play to hold more product. Um, has the same footprint in the uh, store. Now let me show you how the salsa tray works. You want to come close here. This one has lots of scores on it. So this one again, you want to make sure you're you're folding it on the score line. You see a double score here we're folding it over all the way onto itself. So you want to take and you get a nice sharp line, you want to um, just take a moment and fold those lines over like I'm doing here. And that'll make the piece look a lot better when it's done. And when done, with that extra little care, the display is just going to look sharper and cleaner when it's on the store or uh, on the store floor. Take and folding that over. Like that. And we have the sides. These fold over on the inside. They fold all the way over um, the, uh, the sides do. They get trapped inside of the um, inside of the, the front and back bar. Show you that works. Fold over like this. Snaps in place. Other side. Other end, I should say, does the same thing. Snaps in place, trapped in the middle. And then we're gonna do the, the back or the front. There is no back or front on this. They're both the same same piece. This all catches in here. This will relax uh, over time. The board will give up its memory and uh, it won't even be bending a little bit like that. Now here's some lock tabs. A couple of things are important to note. I have two safety features built in. One, by having this large slot here, it goes over the bell. And that's important. Keep those jars, I think it's eight jars of salsa that sit in there. Keep them from falling out. And there's a secondary feature which we developed was a butterfly tab. It's important to push those in as well. We want these safety features engaged, again, to keep a chance of this salsa tray falling out once it has jars in place. And so there you have it. You have the finished product. Both the uh, three shelf and the four shelf have that option of the uh, salsa tray. You get a great, simple, strong, and sturdy display.